Hi, so my name is Bang from the class of 2010 and um, I went to University, Chulalongkorn University and then after that I pursued my master's degree at Imperial College London. Um, so I studied uh, communication management during my undergrad and for my master's degree I, I did strategic marketing. So and right now I'm currently working as a digital marketing manager for Shell, retail Thailand. Yeah. Digital marketing. So um, digital marketing is my passion, basically. So I, I found myself when I was in undergrad on my my junior year that I really really like you know the the marketing communications, how to you know bring creativity to life and you know make stories of a product or make you know, make it worthwhile and you know, marketing is a special tool and it's a powerful tool that changes people's behavior and it also is a tool that, you know, makes people, makes people uh, have a better life as well. Yeah. So um, the experience that I had at my, um, starting from my undergrad at Chulalongkorn University um, is a Thai university, so um, it was a good place that I, I went in to study communication management and the, the, the big reason that I went there in the first place was that um, I found myself at school that um, I really loved you know making events or having some sort of um, you know parties or throwing anything creative ideas and to bring it into life and so so that's why I pursued my university career at Chilangon University and the overall experience was fun and it was a long stretch of four years. I got a chance to do a exchange program to Bonmat University to, to join the media school as well. So it was a great overall experience. And but yes, for my the the peak of my, my, my study is when I went to um, master's degree, do my master's degree in London at Imperial College London. I never dreamed of going to such a big school and I, I, I worked my myself so hard to, to just to go there, put myself in a situation to succeed, to work and to learn from great um, personalities from around the world uh, with my colleagues and friends as well. So it was a wonderful experience that I had, yeah. Okay, yes. oh, I missed my basketball court. So, um, so basically I, I, I was in the basketball team at, for, at KIS from, from grade eight to grade 12. And me with Sam were the co-captains, and we, we, we got a championship for for the first time for for the school as well. The first time of for KS to to get a championship. Um, basketball here is my you know is everything to me. You can see me anywhere in the morning, lunch break, or afternoon and evening. Yeah, so that's that's what I miss the most. Yeah. Okay, so um, I'll give you you guys a little advice because um. For me, coming from a Thai school, and I joined KS at the end of grade eight, so I found myself, you know, in a situation where English was the barrier for me, and I, have, you know, to have to had only two, a couple years before entering the IB diploma, it was a tough stretch of my life. Like I found myself struggling so hard just to do a presentation, but I went through it. I I, I made it through, and you know, in the end, I I finished the course here and what I can tell you is that you know if sometimes you find yourself you know waking up in the morning and don't want to go to school and um, I think you should find your passion you know passion is everything you know to find a reason why you should go to school not because your parents tell you to but because you really want to go like why do you want to go the school now have a lot of you know courses that we didn't have my class didn't have we didn't have all these you know, tools and facilities that, you know, could provide you with these many options of, you know, you know for you to, to pursue your, your to career. So my suggestion is find, find out your passion as fast as possible. And if, if you don't know your passion, you can consult your teachers, consult your parents and, you know, make a career, make, make a, you know, lifetime of what you need to do at which step in order for you to you know, succeed on those dreams of yours as fast as possible and chase that, okay? okay. Oh, IB Diploma prepared me like, to excel in undergrad. Like, um, I went to a Thai university where 
half of uh, half of the students there came from international background as well, and it helped me in so many ways in you know catching up. For the first time, I did not feel like I fell behind in the class in writing, reading, or listening to teachers and lectures and studying. It it really helped me with you know writing essays and all the little stuff, the listening. It you know it makes it easier. It makes your life easier at uni because you've seen the process of. Everything that you know, IB diploma prepared you for the university, and I believe this is a really strong, you know, strong curriculum to prepare you uh, to become, you know, excel at undergrad, which is another stepping stone for you to achieve your, your dream job for sure. Yeah. Wow. Well, so my f favorite memories, I have a lot actually, but you know, the, the best part of it is to the memories with friends. All of them, because um, coming here, I, I I had my best friend Sam, who carried me through a lot, and you know he he's helped me going through all the English courses, helping me with vocabularies or anything that I misunderstood. You know all the goods and bads. You know the, if you're tired or you feel down, your friends is right there to help you, and you know make sure you succeed with them. And you know at the end of the day, graduate and you know throw your hats with your friends, and go forward.